Isabella and also it's the Beautiful Life channel YouTube owner. So today I'm very glad to be here sharing you what I normally use to do my makeup. So it's the Atomi Adelica set. Woo! Well, Atomi Adelica set, there's four types of color that is involved. It means the classic olive, the lovely daily coral, the intellectual brown, and also the let's see what cashmere burgundy, which is what I'm using today to show you what I normally use in my daily makeup to make me look very fresh, elegant and also in the same time very natural. So why do I really love this set is because it all consists of everything that I need for a daily makeup and looks so natural. And so let's look what does it include, right? The first one will be the eye palette which I personally love it as it have the pink colour, the mood burgundy and then the glitter, shimmer and a little bit of the, uh, we call it maroon but going to a little bit dark pink so it can give a very sophisticated look and very sexy, sometimes a little bit of it. So it's kind of nice with all this colour, with a five colour palette here so that we can control later on, okay? And then we have another one, we called it bronzer to give a very perfect natural uh, contouring to the nose, to the face and to whichever area you want your features to pop up. It is the one that I love as it got three color involved in it. There's nude beige, a light brown and darker brown to really uh, goes and blend well with the contouring so you don't look so dirty while you're applying this bronzer. Okay, this is my favorite actually. I don't really love contouring because I do look a little bit more how to say, uh, a bit messy. It's a bit difficult for me to control to get that look. But yes, this is my favorite one uh, ever since. Okay, this is the bronzer, Adelica. Then we have the blusher, sheer cotton blusher which give a little bit pinkish but not over and then give you a very radiant glow that you are healthy looking and around all the area, the angle, you still look perfectly natural and this is what I look into a blusher, okay? So it's sheer cotton blush, really nice colour that given out to your skin tone. Okay, another one will be the 3D highlighter. Personally, I also don't really use highlighter in my daytime because I do think I look a bit weird and overly um, doing my makeup. But this, I promise you, it doesn't do that. So, because it gives you a very natural glow and then given your angle um, a bit more shinier and glowier and even give you a very glass skin effect. So, because I love it so much, it's really perfect. Uh, you just control it with the amount that you put on your face. If you're going for a very, um, very delicate dinner, you can put a little bit more to give the shine while the light shines on you. You will see the perfect angle glow that you, uh, you, you wanted to do so, okay? So this is my favourite 3D highlighter that I'll apply later on as I'm having bare face right now. I'm not applying any of the makeup. So let's see what, uh, well, what will I look at right after this makeup. So, another one. This set is of course concluded of everything that you need from eye to the nose to the lip and to the eyebrow, right? So, it also includes another five things that inside this set which is the eyebrow pencil which is very easily uh, glide on and give you the shape that you want and also the eyeliner pencil but today I'm gonna use a liquid one to really give me a very sharp look. So, and another one will be the mascara which I favourably prefer. Okay, which is giving you the volume. And let's not forget the lip tint glow, giving you a very healthy radiant glow of the lipstick. As you can see from here. Nice colour and it doesn't really give out that strong look but it's a very natural look you can go daily on. So it's uh, about this way. And yep, you can see it's just a glow and giving you a healthy look, that's all. So later on, I'll be putting all these 8 items on my face to see how I really do it in my daily makeup. But today, I'm going for cashmere baguette which is giving me the look of sophisticated, sexy, a little bit of the pinkish red to go with my outfit today with a black coat. So let's see how does it look. So as you can see from the first application I will do on is my eyebrow to really shape a different uh, angle for me to look more clean, more groomed. So we'll be using this Adelica. Okay, a Delica Soft Brow Pencil. So this colour is dark brown, so it really matches with my hair today. So yeah, let's see how does it. So you go it by yeah, applying this. Okay, on, on my 
brow. This is a very simple, okay? It has a diamond shape, so you see, you can really, really see the diamond shape in here. So it's very easy for you to apply. Okay. So a little bit more sharper edge. Hold on a bit. So here you go. So you see a very more fuller look. Instead of here, there's a gap. And you brush it out. Okay. Nicely done. Apply a little bit more for the edge to grow. So a little more edgy for the texture of the color. Okay. And then this way. So you can see here eyebrow shape here and then here you will see here is more fuller already okay so I'll continue with another side and so I already have my two brows done looking very very um, sharp edges and now go to the next one let's see what we will do for the eye eye makeup okay the eye palette the cashmere burgundy so this is how it looks. Uh, the color is really shining and really natural when we put on. So first of all, of course, we will do the base color, okay? We take this one and go to apply on the base of, of it all. See, it's very easy to apply it's on all the area to make your eye more cleaner. A little bit on down here. Down here to clear up. Because my eyes are very deep, so I will clear it up like that. And then back of it all, we will take the second color that is more in that color. So we'll take this one here to apply on inner lids. Okay, inner lids here to the end. Okay, and also from here, give the color because my inner corner color here, you see. See, it pops already. And then a little bit more here, just to go here. So you can see the difference. It's starting to give you that a very moody look already. Very wow, very mysterious. Okay, so on another color, then we'll pick up the small thing here to apply an inner area here, darker, like an eyeliner feel. Then we'll blend a little bit more for the glitter side, okay? Put it in the middle part. As you can see, I was giving you that glow already, middle part a little bit more. Here you go. Okay. Then we'll put more deeper color like eyeliner towards the end, which is this color, you see. So it's more sharp, you see here? Yeah, this is a sharp eye. And here is just without makeup. See how sharp, sharp it is, right? Then we maybe take a little bit of this glitter here, tap it off, and we put it here on the inner corner of our eye to give the pop look. really shining it out then we dab a little bit of the first color here this one to be below here okay. so it's connected really connected from here yeah. so we have a look here it's very more powerful and here it's like blind it out it's very nice and very smooth to apply on and then of course we can use also the Adelica brush to apply on here I have the powder brush the contouring brush the from uh, the blusher brush and also the eyeshadow brush okay. see here we apply the same thing as the base through here easier, it's softer, it's longer to grip as it's at the gripping feel here. Well, it's easy. It's much more easier. 
I'll go for this. Then we'll see what happens if we go on with the full makeup. Then voila, I have my eye palette, um, eyeshadow palette on. My my eye will look a bit more sexier maybe. Okay, let's see um, after the makeup is all done. Okay, so the next one is our bronzer. So first of all, we'll take the brush and take it and slide it like that. And shake it off, the excessive the color. And then we'll slowly go to our nose contouring. Okay, so we just follow your nose area and go to the side. As you can see, my nose area here seems to really helping the sh um, nose become smaller, right? It's like smaller nostril and here is like you couldn't see because I do the shadowing right now. So, another contouring, another part of my nose here. See? It's starting to give a little bit more contouring to the nose and it's a bit more you see sharper correct from the side it's like the shadowing giving you a very um, higher look and it's natural okay so next going to my cheekbone giving me that oh. so you can see here is slimmer here's more pump here you see a lift up here right another here A smaller face. See, smaller already. And then on your forehead, you may need a little bit. So every angle will look more defined. Right? It's more defined right now with my contouring. Definitely a must have in a delicate set. If you're not using this, it's really very you are missing out serious okay so i'm loving this bronzer as you can see it's helping me to give you me a definite features that shine out more it pop it it really pop my features out from the from the cheekbone here and lift it and the nose area that's for the bronzer and see what's the next one will be the highlighter well let's see this is the highlighter i personally used quite long already so it looked like this but of course you get it when it's like it's full alright so first of all I put on my cheek bone here as it helped me to have the lifted look the elegant look okay on the cheek side on the forehead okay so you can see the shine it's very natural from the light itself reflected it's very natural it's not it's not very um how we call it say it's fake but it's really shining out and I'm using my hand okay, I'm using my hand here line glow so I can really see my nose get higher a little bit see? nice very well done a little bit here a little bit here a little bit here and then we want to make my our eyeshadow pop right we just let it here so you can like well stronger glow thank you also see perfect glow so natural right thanks because never forget the blusher so same thing, brush it out. Today I'm gonna do maybe across here the sunburn look. So I'm gonna like make it a high type. Oh the sunburn look. So yeah, we have that sunburn look. I connect it with that. So what does it feel like sunburn? A little bit elegant but cute at the same time. Okay. Alright, so next the eyeliner. Well, today I'm using the liquid one. You can use a pencil one for easy, uh, so that you, you can control it very easily. So I'm using the pen liner, okay, across here. It's very easy. Control. So give me that look. More sharp will end, right? So I've done my one of my eye here. You can see how sharp it look, right? Okay. So next to the same one here. Now we have the eye done. Of course, we'll be going for the mascara. So volume mascara. Let's see what it have. Well, amazing, isn't it? Straight away extended the eye. Pop it out like that. Wow, amazing. 
I'm loving it to become makeup. It's really giving that wow. Can you see the difference? This is a volume mascara on this side I have not yet applied and I love applying uh, the lower lash also to give a little bit pop. So, let's see the lower lash. Lower lash and upper lash. You can see this is a really big difference. It's really popping out my eyelashes out. Okay, same goes to here. I'm gonna do it repeatedly. Okay, I have everything set on. My mascara is on. My eye is pop, and I already applied a Delica Lip Team Glow, which is this color. I'm loving it late, and it's very nice. It's not okay. I'm applying it. It's glossy. It's natural. It's not very. Um, dangerous red that gives out the the vibe that is too strong. It's really subtle. I'm loving it. It's everyday makeup. You can wear it every day to going out. So here it is, the look of Adelika Cashmere Burgundy. for the set of Adelika Cashmere Burgundy makeup look on me and I hope you like it and of course if you like to add a little bit more um, long lasting effect you can go with Adelika loose powder okay I'm having this right now and there's like purple pink very beautiful and help you to set up your makeup even better so pop it off and start dabbing on the excessive oily look that you have especially on your love line. So, see? It's a little bit more matte without so glowing and it's still very natural. This is Adelika Loose Powder. Loving it. It's pretty. It's easy to bring around and it set off your makeup without smashing it from your mask. Okay? That's it. So, let's see the full look with my hairdo. I'm kind of